Hello friends, how are you all? Welcome to my PharmaQC YouTube channel. Today in this video, I am going to explain about what are all the advantages of HPLC as well as what are all the disadvantages of HPLC. First of all, when it comes to say about advantages of HPLC, first one is it offers high separation of efficiency and speed up analysis. Second one, it requires less amount of sample and allows continuous monitoring of column effluent. Third one, the results obtained are precise, accurate and reproducible. Fourth one, absorption, partition, ion exchange and size exclusion, column separation can be done by this HPLC. Fifth one, various developmental techniques of chromatogramics like isocratic elution, gradient elution are possible with the HPLC. Sixth one, modern HPLC instruments can be easily integratable. These are all the advantages of HPLC friends. Now I am going to explain about what are all the disadvantages of this HPLC. First one, maintenance cost of this instrument is very high. Second one, preparation of sample is laborious and time consumption. Third one, HPLC columns are very expensive. Fourth one, pre-treatment procedures like degassing, filtration are required for the mobile pace. Fifth one, skilled and well-trained personals are required for this operation of this HPLC. Sixth one, large amount of solvents like mobile pace, these are all the required for the separation. The components of the HPLC is solvent reservoir. Here we are having different types of pumps. Pump port A, pump port B, pump port C, pump port D, needle wash and seal wash. Here we are filling the solvents. So we are calling solvent reservoir. Second one, purge valve. Purge valve is using for the giving purging. Third one, auto sampler rack. Here we are putting the vials, whatever we are preparing the sample, that vials we are here replacing. Fourth one, column compartment. Here we are placing the column. Fifth, there are different types of HPLC detectors we are using. Variable wavelength detector, diode array detector, refractive index detector, photo diode array detector. These are all the components of the HPLC system. Next, the types of HPLC columns are first one, guard column, second one, fast column, third one, capillary column, fourth one, analytical column, fifth one, preparatory column, sixth one, dermatizing column. These are all the types of the HPLC columns we are using for the HPLC systems. This is today's topic friends. If you have any doubts, please put a comment in the comment section. I must reply it. Thanks for watching my Pharma QC YouTube channel. If you didn't subscribe my channel, please subscribe, share and like my Pharma QC YouTube channel. Thank you friends.